smell me, naked among wolves. Attention all attendees. The keynote dissection and luncheon will be starting in the operating theater in five minutes. How do I get to the elevator? I don't think I want to mingle with this crowd. Dr. Defoe, please report to the quarantine grid room. Dr. Defoe, the quarantine grid room. Thank you. Oi! You don't belong there! All nurses are reminded to file their mandatory volunteer schedule by Thursday afternoon at 5 o'clock. Congratulate Nurse Elizabeth Neal for winning the Waste Not Want Not Award for her adaptation of a crash cart into a file for frequently used forms. Here, here. You're looking nice and trim. We're life for noise. Pop a joy. If you want to be a happy idiot again.
remember his face. Take these all the time, and I wouldn't have any worries. Section luncheon. Lunch will not be served in the cafeteria today. If you are not attending the luncheon, please make other arrangements. in the book. Suppose this always the dissection of the Not the lying stratum is great of English. That argues for Saxon displacement of the Aboriginals rather than some sort of assimilation, doesn't it, Dr. Graves? <laughs> Not babbling in Cornish, are they? Hmm. I suppose I should stick to my knitting there. Oh, this is interesting. Degeneration is sort of spongiform here in the cerebellum. No wonder they lose their sense of balance. If only they could talk. All we could learn from them about their encephalof... Encef... No, it's encephal... Perth... The, the problems with the brains. You've got no business here. She'd figured it all out. Yeah, really? 
I read Miss Olson's notes. Did you know we mixed joy mushrooms and chemicals and created mutant spores that drive people loony? You don't belong here, do you? Obviously, we still had to take her in for uh, observation. Can't have newspapers publishing inflammatory nonsense. Just rest in my feet. This is a reminder that the bottles marked alcohol so that was rather contain isopropyl alcohol inconclusive. and not ethyl alcohol, However, and consequently do not go well with fine water and ice. We thought that if we applied electrical stimulation to the broker's area, we might enable the subject to speak, which would have proved obviously useful. We had a subject in stage one of the plague, just beginning to revert to old English. We even had a linguist ready to translate, but we obtained a very odd result. I'll just use a bit of juice here.
The quarantine floor is currently under quarantine. If you need access to the quarantine floor, please see Dr. Milton for a key card. I gotta drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. you keep your key cards unfortunately the panel ah, the key card off the quarantine I go yay to lack of registrations if you were interested in the panel but did not register please communicate this to Sophia Jex Blake as there is still time to reschedule Why are you being stupid, Arthur? Well, what's wrong with this move? Checkmate. Inform moves. How? I move my bishop here. So you just have to go there. So, I put my rock here. So, you could only move there. Or there. But then, I put my other rook here. Do you, do you see? What you want to do is go here. Why are you knocking your king down? Because I'm not playing you anymore. You're playing you. I can't hear you. Let's make some tea. Do you want to play again? Maybe in a little while. Oh, Arthur. Yes, Percy? What's a sore loser? Oh, touche. All right, set them up. We'll go again. I like playing chess with you, Arthur. in my feet.
Get up. You pick what you can carry easily. something away before something starts chasing you. Take all this with you. Be... I can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. easily.
Quarantine grid. Oh, I hope I don't regret this. Attention all staff. Gotta drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. Please consider him armed and dangerous. Be on your guard. been waiting for you. How long until the coconut joy takes effect? There we go. Lovely. Now, Dr. Brooks is going to bring in a series of disturbing stimuli. Hopefully, with the coconut joy I've given you, you won't be a bit bothered. We won't actually see the stimuli. There's a blind between us and you. And a blind between you and the stimuli. It's what we call a double blind experiment. Off you go. Don't forget to write. <laughs> That's my little joke. I know you've forgotten how to write.
is properly calibrated. Ah! <laughs> 